Take two. Are we recording? Yeah, we're recording. I mean, you know, just casually. Just pretend we don't know that there's a camera looking right at us. Yeah, I know. So, uh, you know, it could be have, like, it's actually pretty good, like a nice lighting. So I don't even have to think about lighting. And then we have a nice, our cops, coffees. We should have our logos here. Oh, yeah, we should get cups. Mugs. I always thought we should get mugs with our logo it's, on it's it. It's nice to give it out. Like right. If it, it's mugs like that. Which and is then, just a veteran show. Yeah, we're talking about marketing here right now. Um, just so that you know. Um, yes. Yeah, so it's uh, this is how we run our business. Just uh, very spontaneous. Yeah, there's no, a, there's a lot no of plan. science. A lot of science to a our lot decisions. Of science. We, just, we decided to record something and we start talking about mugs. And then we, we go into and the marketing. And the uh, marketing. Here are our entire marketing plan. Yeah. And I, then, I think we should be doing is um, getting nice pens. Like what, when we do a real estate closing, I think we started about three years ago, and then we we talked about pens about three years last ago. three years ago, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> two years ago, and then one year ago. But when we were talking about it, what what I was well, at least my thought was yeah. just as long as they write well. Yeah. But I actually now have changed, and I think they're not writing essays; they're just signing. I think you know the, the, the clients are they're doing like they're buying the biggest trans they're doing the biggest transaction of their lives, or they just sell yeah. a, a a large file. And it's a momentous occasion. And the other day, I think it was Wednesday night, we had clients and the young couple and, and their father who was helping finance the home. And they were signing the documents. And she says to me, like, I give her one of the pens, a standard Bic pen. And she says, you know, this feels anticlimactic. And I said, yeah, you're, you're right. Like, it would be amazing if we have a nice pen. Mm. Like, what is it going to cost us? You know, five like bucks. Five bucks, maybe. Even 10 yeah. bucks. We yeah. go 10 bucks. And we give it only for real estate closings or settlements like not just come in to sign up yeah. it's at the end of the file yeah. so either a mug and and a, and a cup and a pen sign and that's yours it'll it'll yeah i, I think we should do i mean you know it's uh I mean, we looked into it right and i looked into you looked into i did it. yeah we got quotes and then maybe we got uh maybe you should do mugs are little i mean we could do it for our own sake but mm -hmm. then um the quantity wise we have to order maybe thousand pens at the same time but then because we do a lot of transactions, like you said, like, you know, settlement, you know, signing, although we have a lot less, but uh, real estate closing, it's actually momentous. Like it's very moment, like they sign something. Sure. Right? So, uh, yeah. And then, and then they keep that pen. They see it all the time. So let, let's look into it. Sure. Right? So, I mean, you know, as you, as you can see, it's, these are the things that we, we have to constantly think about in terms of marketing. But, okay, let's go back to the topic. How do we start? Like, where, where do we do we have to talk about Western the treadmill story? Because then it's gonna be it's gonna be online. Yeah, and I, 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 I think Jack, wife, our, our wife. wife's gonna watch it. And uh, to be to be fair, at the time you weren't married, so <laughs> so so, the, so the, that's so it, it's 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 more excusable on your end. <laughs> so we're not gonna say that story. Yeah. But you and I, after we were exercising, yeah, like, there you we go, were exercising, exercising, yeah, just casually, yeah, yeah. At, at, at the, and we decided that you know what, it would be cool if our, our paths crossed down the road. Yeah, and who would have thought it was so pie in the sky? Then you know, we're just a bunch of law school kids, we're mature students, mature students, yes. but we have cool knapsacks. Yes, so, that's great. so, so, so we, we're, we're trying to blend in with the yeah, kids. Yeah, 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 backwards hat. Yeah, Do you ever wear the back? I don't think I ever pulled off the the backwards baseball cap at, at uh, school. You know, yeah, the I'm cool not, kids. Yeah, I don't think I did. No, actually, we didn't do that. Yeah. Um, you know, we were the ones that were running home on the weekends to our family yeah. while they were partying in, in, in London, Ontario. Yeah. But yeah. we said it'd be cool if, if, if the paths cross and t 10 years, no, how? I think we, then I think it was six, six years, years later. Yeah. Six years, six years later, later, we started talking. Yeah. Six years later, we started talking. Do you remember when we started talking? I think it was 2000. You came to was, Hamilton. Yeah. I think that was 2016 or yep. 17. Yeah. It had to be before 2017 because I left London. I, I sorry, I left Hamilton, I think, at 2015. Oh, really? 2015, 16. I, yeah. You know what? That was time when I was uh, maybe junior. Uh, I, I went to the London, uh, sorry, the Hamilton for uh, a matter, a motion. Uh, and then I was all like sort of proud because I all gowned up as a lawyer. I went to like, you know, do a like little small thing yeah. in front of the judge. And then I got that done. And uh, and then I think you were uh, associated back then. I think it was right after the article, actually. Right, right. Very shortly yeah, after. And then we talked about it briefly. It's, you know, it's. So we we met for coffee yeah. in downtown Hamilton, the, yeah. 
but I, but I think it really I think it's just the moment in life. It's just just that you know, like your your you know your firm, your you and your father was in the right time and right moment, and I was actually right time and right moment because I was coming out of my uh, old firm to mm-hmm. start a new firm. I actually already started, and but at the time I was actually. Uh, buying out all my practice because before I wasn't so I actually right. had some you know like uh, fee monies to be paid back and I was still linked but I think at that moment I think it was 2017 like early 2017 like May or mm-hmm. April exactly. like we start talking and then uh, I think we the stars lined up yeah and then I think we negotiated a lease and signed it and renovated place a little bit and then we started like 2017 September, September. September. yeah so we are coming we are now three years in three years in Remember right. we were trying to figure out if it was two or three years? It's been three years. <laughs> we thought it we started in 2018. And yeah, like looking yeah. at our lease, I'm like, well, maybe like, not. <laughs> that's when we have a bookkeeper, right? <laughs> we do <we, laughs> the numbers to Jen. It. Yeah, yeah. But, and, and here we are three years later with a fancy, because of boardroom, because of uh, COVID, we've had to yep. upgrade our office to accommodate the out of office meetings. Yeah, this is a nice TV right there. We never had that. Never had that. That's we're, that. We're, we're so indifferent because we, we, for the last three years, we thought about hanging something up there. We never did. We never did. We still don't have any pictures in the reception. Correct. We have one in another room, but we haven't hung it up yet. Yeah, I think we might have to. Yeah. Because okay. like, it's going to go another three years. We just signed up on a three year lease and probably nothing's going to happen until that three year lease. No, but the funny part is, I don't know if we should keep going on, but why not? The funny story is when, when uh, the first Zoom meeting we were having mm. in COVID. So I thought it'd be, it was a, I believe it was a case conference, yeah. family case conference. So I thought, and my client was going to come in. So instead of what other lawyers do, you know, either their laptops or their iPhones, sitting around the iPhone with the client, I said, yeah. I'm going to take it up a notch. And I ran to Best Buy. I could GG, I found a guy to install it the same day. And I was so proud. And my client came in. And we were about to start, and I forgot the charger. <laughs> so we ended so, up sitting around our iPhone <laughs> with a, with a, with, a, with, a, with a, a blank screen. Yeah. So we spent about like you know like, I don't know how many how much money like thousand bucks to yeah. set all this up, and then you end up with your iPhone again, right? Yeah. yeah there you go. And that wow. happened two other times. Since. <laughs> but, but now 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 we're, we're we're streamlining it. So yeah. So you know a lot a lot happened because COVID. You know we're doing like online stuff, video conferencing. Um, you know we're we're just sort of, I think COVID, we were going that way, but lawyers the last one to adapt. So, although, you know, we, we have your father still pinning his message, like paper, on a paper, on, into, on his pin uh, message board. So, yeah, yeah. Uh, but I, I'm sure a lot of the lawyers are like that way because people don't want to change. Suddenly from that to like video conferencing, he's meeting his clients online, you know, doing his own video conference, but it's, it's great. So I guess I get today, well, we're not going to do a long winded video but we just wanted to talk about you know it's been three years you know this is you know uh, two partners with the one senior counsel who's been doing this like 40 plus years and uh, you know we have one junior lawyer it's a small firm uh, but you know we were trying to grow and uh, do our parts and you know do more marketing and you know so I guess today is what uh, September, September 11th you know my so son's birthday Thank you, thank you. Yeah, so, yeah, so good to know. You're not gonna yeah. get him a present? Oh, oh sure. Yeah, well, with, with, the, with the two minute notice, maybe I should <laughs> put it on the firm. Anyways, September 11th, 2020. Uh, you know, this is our. Uh, you know, so just kind of telling you where we are, and then you know, we'll maybe maybe do an update video and see in about a year or two where we are. Yeah, and, that'd be you know, cool. Remember September 11th, 2021. Let's look back and remember how. You start from now, and, from now. Then, and then just keep going and then just, uh, you know, so I guess we, you guys, whoever watching this, you know, this is like a time capsule. Yeah. So it basically saying, means our parents. Yeah. Who else is watching this? Nobody's going to watch this. I can guarantee nobody's going to watch this, but uh, we'll, uh, we'll, we'll do an update as to where we are. And then, you know, I guess it's almost like we'll see how we grow and, uh, you know, our, our, our goal, I guess I, I sent you a little... I had an epiphany at like, you know, three in the morning. So I kind of send a quick email to Avi about, okay, what our vision should be. But the, basically vision is to serve people in the most efficient way with the technology and innovative means to, uh, you know, bring the best legal service to people and, you know, see how, how you know, how much we can get and how far we can go. And in about, I would say 10 years and 20 years, we'll see we're still here in, in one piece. <laughs> and one, one thing about Jay's vision that, that I love, I love everything Jay. Jay, I get these, 3 a.m. memos from him <laughs> occasionally. <laughs> His epiphanies turn into waking me up on my phone with an email indicator. But Jay's, which 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 resonated with me is that he wants to become an efficient firm and and a 
technologically advanced firm, but at the same time maintain that sterling standard to our clients. And that's what my father's firm for 40 years has been. The reputation, the retention is 95% plus. And Jay's uh, clients are, are big fans. And we, we try very hard to have leave our clients with the, the impression that we're not just there to to help them in that moment, but we want to be there to help them on their life you know, uh, journey. And that's what Victoria Show is going to do. Yeah, I, I think because, you know, if you just think about money, um, you know, it just it, it's hard. I mean, the deals we people give us a problem to solve and we get paid. I mean, you know, I'm not saying it's, it's not a good money, but sometimes, you know, when you take on a problem, you have to live with the problem of the people. Correct. So if you just focus on the money, sometimes I feel like it's not worth it. But then when we have grateful clients, when we solve an issue, people, people are happy or they can, you know, go on with their life. I guess that kind of gives you some satisfaction and fulfillment in life. Right? Absolutely, and I think that's uh, I think that's what we are to strive to do is to to the best. And I I can't say that we do all our clients are hundred percent satisfied, but I, I would say a lot it's of them are. Right yeah, and then you said that we have a lot of returning clients, clients referring other clients and stuff. So, anyways. Um, I'm, I'm just going to have to cut it short because I don't want to make this video. It's already long, yeah. but I don't know if I'm going to post it as is, but you know, we'll, we'll, we'll see what Jay's editing skills are now. Yay. Make you look skinnier and taller and yeah. wearing a suit. It's wow. Friday. I'm casual. So again, yeah, I'm casual too, but I mean, we'll, we'll see how it goes. Okay. Thank you. Well, we're putting me at a spot, right? No, it's uh, all the best. Adios. Take care. Bye. Oh, you speak Spanish. Hey. <laughs>